Today and every day, I'm going to pick this up, I'm too tall for this. <laughs> I met the man that I manifested by mistake. I thought him up in my head, just like Sylvia Plath said. And as it was written by the complex calligraphy that is my life, so it was. <laughs> it was a mysterious maze of mental anguish that soon soothes me when I realise that he is the first time I'm afraid, really genuinely afraid to fuck up. And I'm actually not trying to escape, which is really not Aquarius. <laughs> I'm not trying to find something in him or fix myself with him, I just like him. <laughs> I just love him. And um, so I kind of stay up all night wondering what happens when he's gone, because they always go. Um, and I have these dreams where he's gone and I awake shaking and only soothed by this other dream I have sometimes where we're in this mundane siege in the back seats of the cinema and he stays and he holds my hand and I'm kind of wondering if we're going to die or not but <laughs> I kind of also don't care because well you know he's by my side and I don't remember what's on the screen and I don't remember the faces behind the guns, but I do remember the way he holds my hand. And I do remember the way he pulls me into his chest and how safe his embrace feels. And, well, this is the worst part because then I'm awake. And, <laughs> well, my mind is a bitch because, well, I'm back to being afraid. And, you know, I like him. And he is the first one to be, I hate this phrase, but the one <laughs> for real, or at least I think so. Because everything's different when it's me and him, him and her, and oh my god, we're so fucking special. <laughs> and I'm pacing through pages of memories, wondering if I'd ever spent hours at peace with the peaks and flows, conversation and then silence. Wondering if I ever wanted to, like, be a better person, or stop blaming all of my fuck-ups on my astrology sign. I will never stop doing that. <laughs> or maybe, if I'd ever known I could be a better person. Wondering if I had ever felt my heart glow at the thought of a man washing a car, because it's cute when he does that. <laughs> I don't know. And suddenly I want to be better when it's for him, and... I want to dream about him, but I want to be awake so that I can be with him. I really feel the need to point out, he's my first boyfriend that has a proper job and that's a big deal for me. <laughs> 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 he's a paramedic, it's, it's a major. Um, anyway, thank you very much. <laughs> charity. This is the first poem she's written since primary school and we're the first people to hear it. There is a trigger warning for sexual assault but please welcome people. 